and the world is a buzz with talk of carbon capture and climate change. But did you know that nature has its own tiny superheroes? Doing just that, scientists have recently unlocked a secret hidden in the blueprint of blue-green algae, also known as cyanobacteria, uh, that could revolutionize agriculture and our fight against climate change. Um, cyanobacteria, notorious for their sometimes uh, toxic blooms in lakes and rivers, are actually powerhouses when it comes to capturing carbon dioxide from the atmosphere, their secret weapon. A uh, carbon dioxide concentrating mechanism, CCM, that enables them to fix carbon at an astonishing rate, uh, far surpassing ordinary plants and crops. Um, at the heart of this CCM lies a large protein compartment called a cartboxy cell, where two key enzymes, CSOSCA and Rubisca, work in perfect harmony. Um, Suska creates a high concentration of carbon dioxide within the cartboxy cell, while Rubisco eagerly gobbles it up, transforming it into sugars that the cell uses for energy. Um, well, scientists have long understood the role of Rubisco in photosynthesis. The regulation of Kasaska remained a mystery. Um, however, recent research has revealed an unexpected connection between Saska and a molecule called REBP, which acts as a switch, activating Saska only when enough REBP is available. Uh, think of photosynthesis like making a sandwich. Carbon dioxide from the air is the filling, but a photosynthetic cell needs to provide the bread. And um, that's REBP, Dr. Ben Long, lead author of of the study um, explains, um, just like you need bread to make a sandwich, uh, the rate of turning carbon dioxide into sugar depends on how fast RUBP is supplied. He concluded uh, uh, this intricate dance between uh, CSOSC and RUBP ensures that the carbon fixation process is highly efficient. Uh, only occurring when the necessary resources are available. This discovery has significant implications for uh, agriculture and climate change mitigation. Imagine crops that can capture and utilize uh, carbon dioxide as efficiently as cyanobacteria, okay? Um, this could lead to vastly improved crop yields, reduced demand for nitrogen fertilizer and irrigation, and uh, increased resilience to climate change. Uh, it's a win-win scenario for both farmers and the environment. Uh, um, maybe, in fact, 20 to 10, 60 million waves, dollars won because various infections, uh, investors all over the earth, so that just shot out of lathes. While the concept of creating super crops might sound like a plot from a futuristic novel, it is inching closer to reality with each scientific breakthrough involving cyanobacteria. Known as tiny carbon superheroes, uh, these microorganisms are proving instrumental in our quest for sustainable agricultural practices and enhanced food security. This shift toward engineering advanced crops capable of more efficiently processing atmospheric carbon could drastically change how we approach um, uh, food production and environmental conservation. Uh, um, continued research into the complex mechanisms of nature is revealing new methods to address some of the most critical challenges facing our planet today. Uh, a prime example of such innovation is the discovery of the interaction between the CSOSC enzyme and repeat a relationship that significantly enhances the process of carbon fixation. Um, this discovery highlights the intricate and dynamic nature of biological processes and underscores the immense value of scientific exploration. Um, understanding how these small yet powerful organisms function opens the door to potentially game-changing applications and agriculture and ecology. Um, uh, by leveraging the mechanism cyanobacteria use to capture carbon, scientists are poised to develop new technologies and crops that not only improve yield, 
but also contribute to a more carbon efficient environment. These advancements could lead to substantial improvements in how we manage agricultural sustainability and respond to climate change, providing a dual benefit to both humanity and the natural world. Um, through diligent study and innovative thinking, we are on the cusp of harnessing the full potential of these microscopic powerhouses to foster a healthier and more resilient planet. Uh, the study is published in the journal Science Advances. Like what you read, bribe to our newsletter for engaging articles, exclusive content, and the latest updates. Um, check us out on EarthSnap, a free app uh, brought to you by Eric Rawls and Earth.com.